to my channel. Thank you for visiting with me today. So today we have a new wig. Now this isn't an expensive wig. Uh, when I see a wig, if it's under $20 and I like the pictures, I'm willing to try it out. Um, you know, just willing to give it a shot. And I saw this on Sheen. I didn't know how to feel about it, but they do have a lot of wigs. Now they have human hair wigs. This is not one. This is a synthetic wig, as you can tell by looking at it. But I don't know. I thought it was pretty in the picture and uh, the scalp looks good. So I thought, let's try it. So we're gonna get my hair out of the way and put one on. And one day I'll do a, um, an updated wig collection video I need to dig out my Alice in Wonderland wig because I'm going to need that for an event that I'm doing. So we're going to stick the wig cap on. And I'm not going to do this with the got to be glued and everything and trim it and all that because I'm just trying it on right now to see how I like it. I'm trying to find some bobbies because I've got to, I have to pin these things in place because they will fall right off my oddly shaped head. Let's look at her. She does have bangs. She's gorgeous. I don't know the length, but as you can tell, it's long. So let's let's put these little things in place so I can. find my Chucky wig for tomorrow. I just had that out so it can't be too far away. Can you hear me Chucky? Oh here he is. Chucky wig's right here. So <laughs> it's not the best. He's kind of a mess but it'll it'll do for what I need him for. I wish there were these hooked better. Like every wig I own, expensive wigs, inexpensive wigs, the hook is all the same. These little hooks are all the same. I wish that they had like kind that clamped in place, like a wig carabiner or something, <laughs> you know. I know they got to keep it small, but there's got to be a better way to make those little hooks. See, they already came undone, but I'll probably be okay. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I like it. Now, obviously, you can tell it's a wig, but it's fun, though. It's sassy. Oh. I like it. ponytail it if I need to. I like this. Kind of calm down the shine just a little bit because it really isn't too shiny. It fits nice and snug. 
a little got to be glued under it to hold it in place. I love it. I love it. It's so pretty. Let's see what it looks like in the back. So, so hopefully y'all can see that. It's nice and snuggly. Just want to brush the ends a little bit. When you brush a wig, you always want to hold it like this and get those ends brushed. Start on the bottom and work your way up. I like it. I like it. I really do. I think this is a gorgeous wig. Now let's see what it looks like if I ever wanted to do like an up, like do the bangs back like that. So like a low, the low red in is what I like to call this. I would need to definitely pull some of my natural hair forward, which I would just use like a makeup brush or something like this and pull my natural hair forward and blend it in with that with some hair hair makeup um, I believe wolf brand and makeup effects wolf brand and whoever makes the skin illustrator they make a really good like hair paint use. Now we could always trim the bangs and stuff, but I would probably just a couple strays. I would probably just brush it to the side like that or just that kind of thing. Oh, I love it. I really do love it. So this was $18, I think. And for $18, this is a perfectly fine wig. Uh oh, I've got some tangles. I'm gonna get those out. This is, now my most favorite wig of all time that I have was a very cheap wig. It was under $10. And it's not under $10 anymore, but I have a couple of them and I love it because it just blends so well when I want to blend my natural hair into it and stuff. But this, this is a close runner up. Now this is $18 and on, like I said, on the Sheen website, I got it in no time. I know that they're really slow with deliveries from Sheen, but this came really fast, really, really fast. Oh, this will have to be. I love it. I love the fullness of it. It feels natural. It's nice and um, fitted to my head. It's not slipping or anything. I like it. I like it. I love it. I love it. I love it. So I'm just sitting here going on and on about how much I love it. So let me show you what else I got with the Sheen order. I decided I would try their, their fake nails. You know, I don't like to wear nails. So but sometimes I like my nails to look nice for just a very brief amount of time, like a couple hours for an event or something. So I got some of their press on nails. I got these, which I don't really like the whole details on nails. I think it kind of grosses me out a little bit, but it's fine. I thought those were cute. And then I got these and these. Now, the, uh, and oh, and I got a package of these wig caps. The, um, these are all press-on, so they come with little press-on tabs, but I bought a package of press-on tabs from Amazon for, I don't know, they were like six or seven dollars, and it, it's like over a hundred of them, a hundred cards of them, so, like 
whatever 100 times 10 is, you know what I mean? Like a thousand, a thousand tabs. Um, and those tabs are much better than what I find the ones to be that come with these little sheen sets to be. Uh, just the ones that I got on Amazon were a lot better. If I remember, I'll link them down below. I do get a little, little, little something, something back from Amazon uh, because I will use my affiliate link or whatever it's called. If I even remember to do it, I sign up for these programs and I never like link them or talk about them or anything. So, but this time I'm telling you, if you see it down there, it's an affiliate. It's an affiliate link. But you could always just search press nail press on tabs on Amazon if you don't want to use my link um, and you need some. But I love this wig. I almost feel like keeping it on until I go get Marshall. But that, and that's the other great thing about hair like this and wigs is if you get sick of it, you can just take it off, you know, and have your little light head of hair like what I have. Yeah, this is going to require just a tiny bit of trimming, but all wigs require require some prep for uh, the preference of the wearer, you know. But yeah, we're going to need to do a little bit of prep, just a little bit, just a little trimming. Like this stray hair right here does not want to stay back there, so we'll be doing a little bit of that. Um, I don't even really think. I would need to do too much with the scalp of it. Um, but I like it. It's so glamorous. It's so pretty. But anyway, that's it for this vlog. I'll also, if I, 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 if I remember, I'll also link where on Sheen I found this, if they still have it up. Because you know Sheen, they'll have something up there and then you go back and look for it. It's not there anymore. So... Uh, but there'll be similar wigs to this one. In fact, this one was purchased to replace one I had in my, I had put in my shopping cart, but didn't buy it. And then it said it was sold out. So, but then I saw this one, which was very similar to that one. And um, I'm happy I went with this one. I love it. It's very pretty. I don't even think the shine needs to be brought down that much because sometimes you want to bring down the shine in synthetic wigs because it just looks plasticky. But I don't think I need to worry about that too much with this one. I would like this in rainbow colors for clown makeup looks and stuff. But I have, there's another wig I want to get for a creepy clown makeup look I want to do. But anyway, if you like this, I will try to remember to link it below. But, you know, if you shop on Sheen, you you know, you can just go look under beauty products and wigs. And you can look at the synthetic wigs. They have a ton of them. And um, I'm very happy with this one. So, there you go. But um, I will talk to everyone later. And thank you so much for watching. Bye.